Hi everybody, it's so wonderful to be back with you again on my channel. I know that I have not done a video in a few weeks, but hey, just thinking of great content to bring to you and to help you live a better quality, more effective, impactful life in 2019. So if you remember, recently I did a video about the $5 savings habit. Now, this is a Bahamian $5 bill for those of you watching, wherever you're watching around the world, uh, but the same uh, equivalent to the US $5 bill. And the story behind that is at the end of the day, each day after work, you look in your pocketbook and it, whatever $5 bill, whichever whole $5 bill note that you come across, whether it's one, whether it's two, five, however many, you put that five, that amount into a jar, a piggy bank, wherever it is that you have no access to and see exactly what you end up with at the end of the year. So I hope that's going good for you guys. Let's do that so we can just, just ramp up our savings. Okay, awesome. But I would like to introduce another idea to you. How about this? The 30-day the financial diet. Right, the 30-day financial diet. Now, here's how that will go. For the next 30 days, uh, tomorrow is the 1st of March, right? So let's start this tomorrow, March 1st. For the next 30 days, let's, let's kind of give up some things, right? And just see how much money we're able to save. Your morning coffee. So many people cannot go to work without stopping at their favorite coffee shop, Starbucks. We know that perhaps the cheapest coffee, um, um, and you know, you have all the other toppings, etc., that can increase that. It's roughly five dollars. What about if you give that up for the next 30 days? What about if you do it maybe once a week instead of every day, once a week, right? That five dollars daily that you would save, okay, let's say you do it five days a week, you have a five day work week. And so once a week you do it, you would have saved $20, $20, and you spend that one $5, say on a Friday, as a treat, at the as an end of the week treat. How awesome would that be, right? When you go into Starbucks, or whichever is your favorite coffee shop, when you go into Starbucks, how about just not even looking, not paying attention at all to the accompanying treats and snacks? Those easily can be three, four, five, six dollars. You know what it is, the banana nut loaves, the the uh, cream cheese, uh, Danish, uh, and, and soap, the breakfast sandwiches, whatever it is, how about you just close your eyes, develop tunnel vision, go there on a Friday once a week, order your coffee and get out, right? Get out. You would be very surprised to know at the end of the week, at the end of this 30 days, how much you would have saved. Hmm? Now, I'm going to get to a very, very sticky point for a lot of us girls. How about for the next 30 days, we give up the hair and nail salon? Now, I wear a lot of protective styling, and so you may say this easier for me, but I bet it's easy for you as well. If you don't wear protective styling, you can certainly find ways, creative ways to style your own hair and see how much money you save. That weekly trip to the salon is easily minimum, minimum $70, minimum. And then if you get your nails and your feet done every week as well, that's easily $150 a week, $150 a week. So how about for the next 30 days on this financial diet, the 30 day financial diet, that you give that up. And let's come back March 31st or 30th and see exactly how wonderful we did. Guys, this is for you as well. You too have a coffee habit that you do daily. Uh, whatever else it is that men do daily. Of course, men, it's not as, 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 as expensive for your upkeep on a weekly basis, but you do, you have some habits as well that you can modify for the next 30 days. Guys, let's do this wonderful 30 day financial diet and let's see the money that we're, we save at the end of the month, at the end of March. How about that? By the way, what am I doing? I started already. Look at this. Here is a bottle of water that I put some matcha in, some noni, and some unamate. Shake it up, and I drink it, and I love it. And I feel good. Didn't spend a penny. Okay? So, hey, happy savings.